You know, everyone has walked out into a parking lot and forgot where they parked their car, right? Oh, it happens to me on the regular. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, normal people search until they find it, right? Yeah, maybe well, absolutely. Otherwise, you're not going anywhere. Right. Maybe you use your key fob and like set off your own alarm just to see, you know, if you can find it or something like that. Normal people. Yeah. But Bradford lives in Florida and he's not normal. Okay. And this is our setting the bar story. Uh Uh-huh. So if you can manage to make it through the day without losing your car, then deciding to steal a new one, then letting that car get hit by a train, you're doing okay. Wow. I know. That's an interesting chain of events. Yeah, that was a lot to unpack, and there's more. So, (laughs) Brad... Bloodshot kind of, like, tells the story of that a little bit. Like, yeah, he was through some stuff. Yeah, to Florida we go where Bradford was at a bar, and, you know, listen, he did what everybody has done from time to time. He leaves the bar and couldn't find his car, so he did the only logical thing, stole someone else's car to go drive around and look for his. Really not the only logical thing. (laughs) (laughs) So, he ended up stopping the stolen car on a set of train tracks why why there i don't know maybe he thought he saw his car and was like whoop there it is then okay so that it wasn't stalled he just decided to park it there so then the car ends up getting hit by a train while he's running away then he finds a nearby fruit stand vandalizes that for some reason tries to steal a forklift he found because transportation and then someone had called the cops by that point and then when they show up bradford being the genius he is he sees the cops coming for him tries to flag him down like he was in trouble oh wow and said hey i need help finding my car okay he's he then he's like going straight into dude where's my car mode right yeah. Bradford got into trouble. Yeah, I bet. That, yeah. that is a lot that happened. Yeah, he had a very eventful night. I bet. He, he does. Yeah, you can, again, you can tell by the picture. He had a rough night. <laughs> he did. He we'll, had a rough night. We'll have to tweet out the story so you can see the picture Kelly's referring to. Uh, uh, but yeah, said to the bar, a little Florida story. If you can manage to make it through the day without losing your car, stealing another one, then letting that car get hit by a train, you're doing okay. I love the fact that he... ninety nine seventy JX.